case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The 1972 Supreme Court case, Eisenstadt v. Baird, centered around the constitutionality of states treating married and unmarried persons differently when it came to access to medical care and fundamental rights, specifically under the Equal Protection Clause of the 14th Amendment. William Baird was convicted in Massachusetts for giving a young woman vaginal foam after a lecture on contraception. This action violated the state's law, which only allowed married individuals access to contraceptives with a prescription from a registered physician or pharmacist, while providing access for those seeking to prevent the spread of disease. Baird challenged the constitutionality of the law, arguing it violated his 14th Amendment rights. The Supreme Court agreed that the law was discriminatory and violated fundamental human rights, including discrimination against unmarried individuals and others seeking contraception for pregnancy prevention. The court ultimately overturned Baird's conviction, citing the constitutionality of the law and ensuring equal protection for all individuals seeking contraceptives. The court held that a distribution ban must apply to both married and unmarried individuals to prevent violating the Equal Protection Clause. The right to privacy, covering decisions about having a child, belonged to individuals regardless of marital status. Legislation conflicting with human rights was deemed unconstitutional, and laws had to be imposed generally, not selectively. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class behind.